What's up, y'all? With the Film Culture News, it's your boy Dre. The Atlanta University Center is a collection of black colleges located right outside of downtown Atlanta. The center is home to Morehouse College, Spelman College, Morris Brown College, and of course, Clark Atlanta University. It is not just known as a place where black academia and gatherings happen, but it is also its own version of black Hollywood. The AUC has been known as a place to go when Hollywood wants to make movies and shows that center around black college life. The AUC first appeared on screen on Spike Lee's 1988 movie, School Days. Spike Lee is a proud alumnus of Morehouse College and he credits his filmmaking career with the teachings that he received from Clark Atlanta University. School Days was my four years at Morehouse jam packed in a homecoming weekend. But I have to say, I took my major across the street at Clark College, now Clark, Clark AU. The film follows the lives of Dap, Half Pint, and Julian, and showcases the ever popular homecoming tradition at HBCU. From the parties to the pledging and the pop and coronation ball, School Days takes on us on a journey through the AUC as we explore fictional institution of Mission College. Filming initially took place in Morehouse College, but after a few complaints, Morehouse kicked Spike Lee off the campus and he had to resume filming at CAU. Jasmine Guy, Kadeem Hardison, and Daryl M. Bell were all featured in School Days and went on to star in A Different World, another production that had its eyes set on the AUC. Although A Different World was shot on sound stages in Los Angeles, the transitional scenes were shot mostly on the campuses of Spelman and Morehouse College. What if the dean sees you? My father paid $55,495 to see me cross that stage, and I'm gonna cross that stage. In 2002, Drumline used the campus of Clark Atlanta University as the backdrop of the fictional college of Atlanta a and The stadium, dormitories, and library were all used to set the tone. Morris Brown College and their marching band played a major role in the film as well. Scenes were shot at Herndon Stadium on Morris Brown's campus, and Nick Cannon's character, Devin, almost transferred to Morris Brown throughout the film. Filming did not stop there. In 2007, a brand new film about HBCU life was about to be released. Stump the Yard debuted and showed people about the updated version of Greek life on campuses of historically black colleges and universities. Throughout the 2010s, shows and movies such as The Quad, Ben Mary Jane, Boomerang, and the sequel to Drumline, Drumline A New Beat, were all shot in the AUC. Not only has the AUC been a large backdrop for Hollywood, but it has also produced some of Hollywood's biggest stars. Spike Lee, Kenya Bears, Keisha Knight Pulliam, Samuel L. Jackson, and Kenny Leon are a few AUC alum who have emerged from the West End of Atlanta to the stages of Hollywood, California. With the Film Culture News, it's your boy Dre. Make sure you follow the film culture and keep up with all things black culture. Peace.